Last month, the inaugural session of the Botswana-Namibia Binational Commission has identified a number of cooperation agreements which could increase trade between the two neighbors. Introduction of IDs for travel, joint bid to host the AFCON tournament and the subsequent envisaged infrastructure and the sharing of water resources are just some of the plans in the pipeline. The close relationship between him and his counterpart, Mohoetsi Masisi, President Gengob says, makes it easier for the implementation of policy decisions by the two countries. Our situation is very good because at our level we, have, we can call each other. Yes. I pass and you guys. Yes. 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 That helps us. Yes, it helps a lot. A, a lot to decide on certain things. Yes. Or consult on the situation for the yes. world affairs, African affairs. Yes. Bilateral affairs, so it helps a lot. And then we can guide yeah. you guys properly yes. to develop technicalities. Yes. So I'm really glad that we have that kind of relationship. Yes. Which we are expanding to all the regions. I just came from Botswana, uh, from Zambia. Yeah. They would have been the same. South Africa, so that we have that kind of relationship. Yeah. So it's good that we can communicate. Namibian and the Botswana governments also agreed to establish a one-stop shop at the Mamuno Transkalahari border post. The latest from the Namibia Revenue Agency is that a draft implementation plan has been shared with the Botswana Unified Revenue Services before it reaches the two presidents. Namra's commissioner told NBC News that a steering committee comprising officials from both countries has been set up and the process is being finalized. It's really now the issue of ensuring that the office building is in place because what is going to happen with this one-stop border post? Instead of someone now stopping at uh, Mamuno and in also Transkalahan, uh, where you are stopping at the border operation of both countries, that's going to stop. You, when you, if you are going to Botswana, you only stop at one side, let's say maybe the Namibian side, Transkarahari, then at that, in under one roof, you will then find customs, they will do the customs operation, then you will find immigration, the police, um, agriculture, all other border agencies, they will do what they're supposed to do at one border post. Then you will just go, you don't need to stop twice. And that is really going to improve service delivery, it's going to save traders from spending a lot of time at the border. The outgoing High Commission of Botswana, Dr. Serema, is satisfied with the progress. Yeah. Nowadays, I feel happier when I go home through the border. I see now many trucks, which means trade has, yeah, has gone up. Yeah. But then they shouldn't be parked there. Yes, yes, they indeed. So <laughs> <laughs> I hope the, the, your launch next year will be yeah. able to lift, uh, yes, and improve things. Yeah. Yes. 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 No? So you are saying goodbye, so. Yes, yeah. goodbye, so. Talk to the, the Motswana diplomat has served in Namibia for two and a half years. Blanche Corres, NBC News.